Hey guys, I know this video has taken a while but finally it's here so I took a snippet of last week's vlog and added it here just to give you guys who are new here a glimpse of how the kitchen looked like before. I didn't take any uh, before clips so this is basically how the space looked like before. So the first thing we did is repair all the damage we did to the walls. This is where the black shelves were nailed. So we filled the holes uh, sandpapered and then started on the paint work. The color of paint I chose to go with for the kitchen was brilliant white and dusty pink for one wall. This is how the other side of the kitchen looks like. I really don't like the brown cabinets at all. So we are going to temporarily wrap them because this is a rental so that they match with the rest of the space. So we are in day two and as you can see the wrapping of the cabinets has started. We removed the silver handles and replaced with gold at the end. The doors that have been removed are the ones they are going to wrap tomorrow. guys so it's been a while and uh today is sunday when this video is supposed to go up and this is when i'm filming um the final part of the kitchen i need to now arrange everything but first i want to take you guys through on all the renovations um that has been happening throughout the week um I wasn't able to film as the work was getting done because I wasn't around, I was at work. So I'll just come back in the evening and I'll find um, this huge process that, that has already gone on. But I tried to uh, do like before how the kitchen was uh, and like as work was going on. Another thing I forgot to film to you guys was the paint work. But now I can't film, um, I can't show you how it all uh, looks like because the cabinets are here as you can see uh, one just right behind me um, the cabinets are here so um, I want to arrange um, all my utensils in the cabinets and then I'm going to wait for the interior designer so that she can come uh, we decorate the entire kitchen with her so I want to take you guys through on all the changes that i made and how um the kitchen currently looks like then we'll arrange the cabinets then finally decorate then i clean the floors i need to clean these floors um then we'll be finished uh with the entire kitchen my house has been a disaster this week as in i've had those kind of weeks where i just enter the house and i was like i feel like can i just go back to work because <laughs> the house is a mess I've realized if the kitchen is a mess, uh, there's nothing much you can do in the entire, um, the rest of the house. So, let me show you guys what happened. Let me show you guys um, the cabinets. I'm so happy about the cabinets. Ah, my interior designer did such an amazing job. And she removed all those stressful dealing with fundies. I hate dealing with fundies. So she removed all that stress of dealing with fundies, calling, uh, going to inspect to see how uh, the work is. And she did such a good job. She kept time. That's the one thing that I, I don't know who her fundi is, but I want <laughs> the contact for her fundi because she kept time on everything. She said she'll deliver this day and she delivered this day and everything came out uh, looking amazing. So let me just take you guys through that. Also, I was talking about the paint. We painted this uh, one wall pink and the rest uh, white. So the color of the pink is called, I think, dusty pink uh, from Crown. So we only painted this particular uh, wall pink. I was expecting um, this space to be opened so that um, at least you can see the pink, but I don't mind. Um, I just, the theme for the entire kitchen um is pink white and uh gold so we will add a bit of green here and there for the plants but this is how 
I don't know it doesn't look yeah that's a real shade that what you're seeing now is a real uh, shade of pink that we put on I keep changing the camera and it keeps changing um, the shade according to the light so the cupboard here is the first cupboard we put here this is how it looks such neat work um, the workmanship was so nice um, cost also very affordable but the thing that I just love was just the neatness this was just neat work done here so I've already started no I haven't put anything um, on these shelves so this is how it looks um, on the inside Oh, I've put my glass uh, containers here sorry if it doesn't focus uh, yeah put my glass containers there in my dish so that is the first cabinet and this will be like the coffee area so all this I'm planning to put there then we have drawers down here where I've put all my lids and all my kitchen um, basins I put right over there plus all my plastic uh, stuff I've already um, arranged them there then so this is the second one that we made um, it's next to the cooker so it's a bit narrow because I wanted this space to be all open and the door to open fully so um, here I have like my kitchen towels I've put them on this drawer here I have all my cooking pots um, down below so nothing much has changed in terms of arrangement of the kitchen um, on these ones I don't know what I'm going to put here but at least I, I know I have the extra storage uh, if I need it so I don't know why I put the eggs there but anyway I think they'll stay there either way so I have that extra storage on top so there's this um, third cupboard that I hadn't shown you guys um, it came bigger than what I had expected but I think I'll just work with it if not uh, if I find the space is too small I'll just sell it and get a smaller one but so far I like it the way it is so I'm going to it has all our groceries in it like our onions tomatoes uh, potatoes all are in there so um, I don't know I'm okay with the size but if it will be like a problem to move around I'll sell it and get another one so that was the third piece we added um, there so yeah such beautiful workmanship if you ask me um, she did such a great job for me um, and it's stress-free I didn't have to deal with all this um, she just came took measurements asked for the number uh, asked for the sorry the colors that I wanted and I had my things in time she really kept her time and true to her word so yeah this is how the entire space looks like it looks so bit so I'm hoping in a few months I'll be able to get the fridge that I want uh, but now you can see whatever size of fridge I will get I have the space for it because I don't think it will be that much wider I'm getting I'm not getting the double door fridge I'm getting um, the 600 liter one but uh, not double door but it will be tall like I think the size um, of the cabinets over there so yeah so coming to the cupboard side I had all the cupboards wrapped I think I had shown you guys a snippet of the work being done so we decided to change the handles to gold to match the white kitchen cabinets sorry the floors are, have not been washed so this is the part where I can't recommend because the work wasn't done to my standard it wasn't done um, let me just say I wasn't like a hundred percent happy with the wrapping but I don't mind it it's actually it looks good but the finishing wasn't done um, to what I wanted it but see the difference it has done to my kitchen I really really didn't like the brown um, cabinet so she's wrapped on both sides so I'll show you guys the other side so I didn't like how um, the brown used to look like and plus I've done all white on this other side so I needed to actually wrap this side like I said this is a rental so we were doing temporary renovations we couldn't do paint work so the countertops were also wrapped um, with grey because the tiles on top were looking cream they wouldn't have matched with the white so she wrapped um, the countertops also also around the sink 
uh, in gray, in dark gray. So I'm waiting for all the dishes to dry so that I can now uh, arrange them because also we are changing that particular dish rack we are getting uh, we are putting another one there so I'm waiting for all the dishes to dry we've not washed our dishes in the past three days so this is dishes for three days so I'm waiting for them to dry then we'll arrange them in the cupboard so basically that's how the um, the changes that we made in the kitchen. I'm happy about it. it's brightened the kitchen so much um, it Just looks different So coming to the dining table side, this is how they were wrapped also um, She couldn't wrap them completely because the glass was glued to the uh, MDF meaning you can't remove it so that you can wrap around it which I understood perfectly and I, I, I love how it looks uh, nonetheless because the brown kind of matches the brown on uh, my dining table so that was okay I'm okay with that a hundred percent the dining part looks very lovely I have no complaints with the dining part the work was done perfectly there I have no issue uh, so this I just wanted to show you guys how the other side uh, looks like it's changed the entire space it just looks so bright I just love um, this particular change that we did so this is how the dining uh, look like looks like and again we also uh, made the handles gold on this um, side I don't want to say anything Cause if I do, I might say the wrong words Oh no So keep my mouth shut and I listen Afraid I lose you if I didn't Can we find what we're missing And compromise so I got this really cute um, set of plates at Curry 4 I'm unable to get like things that much when it comes to cups and plates so these ones I got are uh, two of each um, they usually they are uh, in the plate section but they like in a separate um, shelf that's carry for to reverse so I usually select um, the pieces that I like and I, I got two of them I really love um, this particular prints over here I'm only putting um, the plates that we'll be using on a daily basis the rest of the other set of plates that I have I put them um, in the cupboard up there in case I ever have like so many visitors that's when I'll pull them down but these are like our everyday um, use the plates that we use every day Don't know what to do anymore. I'm mad at options, nothing's working. I'm out of service. I'm out of service. I'm I'm trying, but can't scratch the surface. So keep my mouth short and I listen. Afraid I lose you if I didn't. Can we find what we're missing and compromise?
so i'm going to do a bit of cleaning before we start decorating i'm starting with the fridge and i'm using the maxwell stainless steel cleaner um, to clean it also don't mind the stickers on the fridge i will work on them uh, soon my nephew used to make us stick them there so for now let me just hide them with the fridge magnets Feel uninvited Left you home in West LA I'm not excited So uninspired On my way to play the bay While you're alone This girl's a wonder She loves me as she needs to know I love her I wonder if we'll make it through this summer Just wanna touch like that um by the way i got this nivea hand cream uh beeswax this one is to protect your hands in case you use water a lot so i got it on jumia and i'm going to link it in the description box down below so i got two of them one is in my handbag the other one is um, i'm keeping it in this particular kitchen drawer um it comes in handy very much for me looking at my cooking spoons and serving spoons now makes me want to get um the matching set in pink i have seen them a lot on ig i think i will order a set soon it will look way better than what i have here now the first place we are decorating is this coffee area plus the shelf itself all the pieces will be linked in the description box down below by the way, i didn't even go for shopping except for the house of leather stuff i bought in my last video all this is rachel uh, who shopped for them some few pieces we reused from my old deco collection that i'm not using anymore cup holder i had before didn't fit in the space so we had to go buy a smaller one i will show you guys later on in the video so this was literally my favorite space at the end of this whole makeover
guys by the time we were done with this kitchen renovation we spent like 30 minutes just admiring this space i love how it turned out such a huge transformation i can't believe it took me this long to transform this space so if you're interested in hiring rachel i will link all her details in the description box i highly highly recommend her her work is just beautiful she's so professional you'll be seeing more of her as i revisit all my other rooms in the house soon we're already working uh, on that with her So for the open shelf we will revisit that space soon we just didn't want to leave it empty so we had to arrange something on it i didn't predict i'll be left with so much storage space at the end So by the time I was editing this video, I had talked to the guys who had dropped the counters and they agreed to rectify the areas I have an issue with. So once they do that, I will definitely plug you guys. Last I got that sinking, sinking in my stomach from that life. Last I Now that I'm seeing this, I wish we got two sets of this uh, hand towel print so that I can be changing just this print alone. I just love, love, love the new look. Can't imagine hanging any other towels in here.
So this is it for this video guys thank you so much for watching as always and i'll talk to you guys in my next video